Welcome ladies and gentlemen, welcome to race preview for the Saturday meeting here at Bangalore as you kick start the race preview of the right sure plate, the first race of the afternoon and we have a look at number one in the card, that's eco-friendly. Let's have a look at eco-friendly's credential, is it a set field or a friendly is a number one eco-friendly, being produced almost on the wide outside, almost seven wide off the fence, started to catch up with the front runner and ran ending up second behind my vision with my vision just taking over the running at this crucial point and eco-friendly charged to come and finish on a long neck second lives to fight another day's one blinkers tongue stop rated at 23 and number two will be elizabeth regina elizabeth regina ran fifth the blue god was the winner and elizabeth regina now been switched over on the outside came and finished on ending up fifth with sunlit path on the outside ending up fourth and uh, this horse, a blue god, ending up winning this race by a margin of three and a half lengths rated at 23 spoon tongue stop and hood three will be tanganika Tanganika ran fifth. Way of Life is the winner of this race. And Tanganika was in that back bunch in the silks of uh, royal blue, white sleeves, quartered cap is uh, Tanganika. Is there a couple of outings? In fact, ran fifth on this outing behind Way of Life is uh, Tanganika. Aki champion out of Escala from Tungsta Cross Nose Band rated at 23 is number three, Tanganika. And number four will be My Visionary with number five, Marco Polo, and number nine, Petslav. These are the three runners with Greeley, the winner of this race. But let's have a look at My Visionary's credential in the silks of yellow, blue, V, half sleeves and blue cap has had three outings. All his three runs disappointing. Twice 10th and 1-6th be an armory from tongue stop rated at 20. Five on the other hand is Marco Polo. Pretty consistent in his last three outings having run third uh, in race number 51, winner beating Raffles and third B and Greeley on this occasion. Spun Tungster Crosses Band rated at 19. And number 9 in the card, that's Petzlau, finished on 6th. Having started off on a good note, with finishing third B and Mega Success, fifth B and Marco Polo, and sixth B and Greeley rated at 12. Spun Tungster Crosses Band and Hood Pacify Blink Cars. Six will be C Diamond, was gracing the wrong end of the field, or C Diamond and ran eighth. Apollo Light was the winner. And Q Vega also coming up for scrutiny, who finished on 6th on the sorting, travelling about 3 deep off the fence, was. Uh, Q Vega, but C Diamond was the one who's had a couple of outings, in fact, and over that uh, distance of 1200 meters, ran ending up eighth on this occasion, having finished fifth B in Russian Romance over that mile trip and sixth B in Way of Life over that San Falong trip. In this occasion, ran eighth on this outing, last, in fact, rated at 19th from Blinkers, whereas number eight in the cut, Q Vega, finished on sixth, rated at 15th from Blinkers. Recreator number seven in the card who finished six Russian romance with the winner and recreators at a Western Arts Center at Sudis Teda is number seven Recreator who's had three outings, all his three runs no uh, nowhere to be cited, having finished sixth on the first occasion Banana Dale, sixth again being perfect Hello, and in this occasion finished sixth over that mile trip in Russian romance is Recreator rated at eighteen spun tungsta cross nose ban. on to the second race, the division tier of the Major C. Newton Davis Memorial Trophy for Maiden Horses, three years old only. We have a look at number one, Gizmo. Gizmo was the one who ran fifth. Masato was the winner of this race and Gizmo was the one who has now been switched over on the outside and ended up finishing on fifth out of seven runners. Masato, the winner, ninth being naughty legend on the first occasion is uh, Gizmo. So, 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 a deserving visit. Beautifully bred horse, ended up fifth on this occasion over the sun for long trip in race number 108. We want to the next runner coming up will be number nine, Super Bold. Super Bold was the one who's out of Chinese whisper, a bold babe, who finished on eighth on the touting in race number 89. You're looking at eighth out of eight runners, last and exceeds win. There you can see it on the top of your screen, ending up last, in fact, is the Super Bold in race number 89. Oh, that uh, six for long trip in race number 89. Exceed put in a smashing performance to win by six lengths in uh, race number 89. We want to the third race, which is the uh, Missouri Stakes. Uh, distance run is uh, 1,200 meters. One will be a display with number seven, Classic Charm, also coming up for scrutiny, followed by number nine in the card, four-wheel drive, and number 11, Lotte Brunen. These are the four runners we go across to, but let's start off with the first runner, a display. Uh, well, uh, this horse ran second behind Maple Leaf on the previous occasion, and in this run ran ninth out of 12 runners. Pretty hard to digest, you know, after a fine second uh, behind Maple Leaf, running ninth behind the Czar on this occasion, from Tongue Stop rate 58. Seven classic charm, yet another runner, which had a good performance in his uh, first three outings and subsequently ran fifth B and Maple Leaf and eighth B and Czar, rated at 50s from Tungsta Crosses by Side Cheek Peas. And number uh, nine in the card, we have a look at his four wheel drive. 
Uh, well, uh, barring that one outing where uh, four-wheel drive ran fourth behind the uh, speculator, his other runs are disappointing. And number 11, Lotte Brunnen, yet another runner who started off on a good note on the first occasion and subsequently never reproduced that form rated at 44 but side check pace. We want to number two, that's Anakin. Anakin ran 10th. Augusto was the winner of this race, and Anakin was the one who finished on ending up 10th, was the winner in race number 55. Started off his first three outings with a good performance, but subsequently hasn't shown that form in race number 66, ran 10th being Speculator, and 10th again being Augusto in his next two outings, rated at 50 cents for Tongue Stamp and Basket Bit. Solo Prince and number six Southern Force are the next two runners, but let's have a look at Solo Prince's credential. Solo Prince was the one who won his uh, first two outings and ran second being Anakin, his fifth being Augusto, and sixth being Maple Leafs from Tungsten Cross no Span, rated at 57, whereas number six Southern Force was a winner in race number 58, and fourth out of 10 runners on this occasion is Southern Force. There you can see it on the inside coming and ending up in that uh, fourth spot over that 1,200-meter uh, trip is the uh, Southern Force, rated at uh, 52 spun tanks up and cross no span is uh, number six Southern Force. And uh, four will be Armstrong. Armstrong ran sixth. The prime best was the winner of this race, and Armstrong was the one who was running in the center of track and ended up finishing on sixth out of 11 runners. Uh, this is race number 13 you're looking at of the current uh, winter run you're looking at. Prime best was the winner, and Armstrong ended up finishing on sixth on the outing in race number 13's from Tungstrap rated at 54. This is the early part of the season where Armstrong ran sixth. Kallu Sakare. Well, back-to-back -back wins uh, coming in from Kalu Sekre, having won his uh, previous outing in race number 75, beating Ahan, and repeated that winning performance in race number 104, beating Chisox in the same class over that uh, sprint distance is uh, Kalu Sekre. Night store at Akari Sinis, one tongue stop rated at 52 is number 5, Kalu Sekre. Well, uh, we mount to number eight, that's Ultimate Striker. Ultimate Striker ran seventh. Augusto was the winner. And Ultimate Striker has had a couple of outings. One second being Chilburani and third being Anakin. Winner beating uh, winner in race number 90. And in this occasion, in race number 94, finished on seventh out of 12 runners in a higher class where Augusto was the winner rated at 50. Macron comes in next. Macron, who finished on fourth, came into that fighting line where Fondness of You was the one who came and challenged up strongly on the outside to come and emerge victorious. And uh, Macron was the one who was also making his run simultaneously, but came and finished on ultimately fourth on this outing. Well, certainly did run a blinder of a race, in fact, as uh, Macron. After that, uh, second being Fondness of You, third being Mars Girl, fifth being Douglas, and fourth being Fondness of You, rated 40 cents per tungsten across the band. We want to the fourth race coming up, the running of the... Uh, Division 2 of the Red Fort Plate, uh, distance is 1,400. One will be Seven Samurai. This is the Mysore footage run you're looking at. Uh, seven Samurai who ran third, B and Rembrandt in uh, race number 50 of the early part of uh, Mysore, where Seven Samurai is out of Western Arts, got out of Exotic Fantasy, or oh, that sun for long trip, ended up third out of 14 runners, rated at 35 spent tungsten across no span. This is number one, Seven Samurai. Two will be Treasure Chest who ran second. Blue God is the winner. We've seen this footage earlier where Blue God is the winner, and Treasure Chest was the one who came and occupied the second spot. Uh, two, three and a half was the margin of uh, victory between uh, Blue God and Treasure Chest. Number three, Everyone Godfather, who ran seventh out of nine and a seventh right throughout, never improved at all as Everyone Godfather. This one tucked across the band rated at 30. And number six in the card is Sunlit Path, who finished on fourth, uh, slowly coming into some sort of form, in fact, is uh, Sunlit Path, having run fifth in his previous outing and sixth being Sassy, fourth year being Blue God rated at 26, one tucked across the band, where uh, Blue God uh, emerged victorious to win uh, clearly off this field by a comfortable margin, and Treasure Chest is putting tongue stop rated at 33. Well, four will be Freya. Freya ran 10th, uh, Crosswater was the winner of this race, and Freya was the one who was in that uh, second last position, and ended up 10th uh, out of 11 runners uh, in that second last position itself. Just beat one home is Freya. Rodrigo Connor out of Zalfano, beautifully bred horse, but uh, ran off the frame on both occasions. In summer, ran 9th uh, being Ricardo, and in this occasion, 10th out of 11 runners has been Cro Cross waters one blinkers tongue stop put rated at twenty seven. Five will be contractor. Contractors are a tail of champion of Katinza, who finished on 11th, uh, with all his three runs disappointing, in fact, as the contractor, having run in race number 37, finished 12th out of uh, 12 runners being Art Calry, 8 out of 11 runners being Crosswater, 11th out of 11 runners being Adjustment. That's the form and credential of contractors, one blinkers tongue strap, rated at 26. 
the blissful lec was the one we move on to blissful lec was the one who ran fifth sheer bliss was the winner and uh, this horse in the silks of black yellow spots white sleeves yellow spotted uh, black cap was the one who was in the third last position and finished on fifth ultimately is uh, the blissful lec this is race number 18 of the mysore season you're looking at and came and ran fifth in the center of the track is uh, the blissful lec shifting power out of lecs one tongue stop rated at 26. Eight will be Chirag. Chirag was the one who ran third. Klimt was the winner, winner of this race. And Klimt was the one who ended up winning this race by a margin of two lengths. Whereas Chirag ran 11th behind uh, Southern Force with 5th behind uh, Cinco de Mayo. And in this occasion ran third out of nine runners in race number 120 of this uh, current season run. Where Chirag uh, ended up third out of nine runners. Uh, will not be carrying a whip in fact as uh, number eight uh, Chirag. This one tongue stop rated at 25. And nine will be Samachar. Samachar ran third. Lone Ranger was the winner of this race have been produced uh, about four wide off the fence and ended up finishing third out of nine runners. Lone Ranger was the winner of this race, having finished fourth be and never given in the previous occasion and tenth be and Grizzly. But on this occasion, third out of nine runners rated at 23 spotting wiser is number nine. Samachar B. Safer of Lady Duff. The fifth race, the uh, Division Two of the Madai Plate, distance run is 1200 meters we have a look at number one twinkle feet who ran fifth agera was the winner of this race well twinkle feet has had a couple of outings ran fifth being fondness of you with fourth being mass girl third being indian blues and fifth out of nine runners fifth right throughout is uh, a twinkle feet this is race number 70 you're looking at and fifth right throughout in fact is twinkle feet rated at 40. two will be worldly wise worldly wise ran 10th high opinion was the winner of this race my footage run uh, in fact this is the chennai run you're looking at of uh, worldly wise where uh, Worldly Wise ran 10th out of uh, 12 runners. Did the running and then gradually faded out as uh, Worldly Wise. Having run, uh, having won a race in Mysore, beating Seoul and a uh, 9th out of uh, 12 runners uh, in the early part of uh, this winter season where Solo Prince was the winner, rated at 40s one tongue strap. Three will be Oolala. Oolala was the one who ran third. Osiris was the winner of this race. Nicely positioned, in fact, and then ended up uh, finishing on... Uh, Third on this outing uh, is Ulala. Subsequently, in race number four, uh, was withdrawn on, uh, was lame on left four and was withdrawn on that race in race number four, in fact, where uh, Madam Rich was the winner rated at 36. Four will be Breeze Bluster. Breeze Bluster ran third. Blue God was the winner of this race and uh, Breeze Bluster ran third on this outing after doing uh, most part of the journey up there in front. Uh, ended up finishing on third. Pretty consistent right throughout the season, having run second being aircraft, fourth being armory, second being Ardican, fourth being Kalusakare, and third on this occasion being Blue God, rated at 34th from Blinkers Cross Nose Ban. Well, five will be Phoenix Surprise. Phoenix Surprise ran eighth. Adjustment was the winner of this race, and uh, this horse, uh, Phoenix Surprise, was the one who ended up eighth on this outing. Hasn't shown that form. Uh, as he had uh, previously in the last summer, in fact, Phoenix surprised and ran 8th out of 11 runners being adjustment rated at 20 times from tongue strap. 6 will be Domina. Domina ran 3rd. Southern Aristocrat was the winner of this race and Domina was the one who started to catch up with the front runner and ran ending up 3rd, having run 2nd being step to destiny and 3rd out of 10 runners being uh, Third uh, on this occasion, or oh, that sprint trip uh, is uh, number six, Domina. A supported a Celestrellus from Tungstra Cross Nose Band Basket, bit rated at 28. We have a look at number seven, Capri Girl, who ran third. Uh, bond Dancer was the winner, and Capri Girl was nicely positioned. Mega Success was just behind and ran ending up second, uh, where uh, Bond Dancer was the winner of this race, uh, waiting to. Uh, uh, Quick in well, and then uh, ended up eventually winning by a margin of five and a quarter lengths as Bond Dancer. And uh, rest were uh, uh, occupying the minor positions with uh, Capri Girl occupying the third spot, uh, spotting Tongue Stuck uh, Side Chick Please rate 27. And Mega Success came and finished on second on the sorting, rated at 25 is number nine. Mega Success, Night Store of Lady Duff. We mount to number eight, that's Naughty in Blue. Naughty in Blue ran ninth. Aldila was the winner of this race, and uh, Naughty in Blue was uh, uh, very prominently positioned and then uh, fell back gradually to end up finishing on ninth out of uh, 12 runners, uh, where Aldila was the winner. Literally quick and well once asked for an acceleration is uh, uh, Aldila. And Naughty in Blue finished on ninth, rated at 20 cents. One blinkers tanks up. No form in his previous two outings as well. Finishing ninth in the Southern Force and sixth in Instructor, rated at 20 cents. One blinkers tanks up. Burning Arrow comes in next. Burning Arrow ran seventh on this outing is Burning Arrow. This is race number 127 you're looking at. Has had almost five outings and all. 
all his five runs disappointing. Once fifth in race number 50, but subsequently ran twice seventh when Greeley and Ramanator is burning arrow rated at 20. The sixth race will be the Division 1 of the Major C. Newton Davis Memorial Trophy for Maiden Horses to three years old only. We have a look at number five, Bowen. Bowen was the one who ran sixth. Excellent last was the winner of this race. And Bowen was the one who finished on uh, sixth out of uh, ten runners. Sixth right throw to a silicon star. Ended up finishing fourth third in the previous outing when Scarlet Lady. And in this occasion, silicon star was nicely positioned. And then eventually in the dying st stages of the race, lost it out to end up finishing on fourth. Be an excellent last is uh, Silicon Star, whereas uh, Bowen finished on sixth. Delavi ran second is Delavi, still having that advantage of almost a length and a half in front, and it was uh, Magical Bay was the one who came and notched up that fine win, been traveling wide, and Magical Bay came and uh, last stride got that nod in race number 31, but subsequently was withdrawn in his next outing in race number 89. Well, we are look at Magnetic. Magnetic was the one who ran, ending up third on the sorting. Is Magnetic in the silks of uh, light blue with gold star. Came and occupied the uh, third spot where uh, Naughty Legend was a runaway winner, winning it comfortably. And Magnetic finished on a fine third spot tongue strap. The seventh race will be the PV Shetty Memorial uh, Cup. And uh, this is a race for horses rated... Uh, 60 to 85. We have a look at uh, number one, Allgate. Allgate was the one who was a winner in race number 26, beating Eternal Princess. And in this occasion, finished on fifth out of 10 runners. As a fancy runner is Allgate, but ended up finishing on fifth out of uh, 10 runners. Eternal Princess was the winner, rated at uh, 78. One Brinker's Tongue Stock. Itaka, number three, English Pay. And number four, uh, Delma. These are the three horses coming up for scrutiny. But let's start off with the first runner, Trip Itaka. Well, after that first two God outings, having run third, being fondness of you, and third, being Douglas, ran and sixth be in Numa with ninth be in Fondness of your second be in Augusto, winner beating Del Mars, one blinkers tongue stop rate 71. English be on the other hand, just one outing, ran fifth out of seven runners, be in Tripitaka, rated at 69. Del Mar on the other hand, finished on second out of seven runners. Tripitaka was the comfortable winner in this race, winning by two and a quarter lengths from tungsten across those band hanging bit rated at 68. Phoenix star out of Alamina is number four, Del Mar. Five will be Fearless Joey. Fearless Joey ran seven. Pink Jasmine was the winner of this race. And Fearless Joey is out of speaking of feature of heaven is here is a Fearless Joey who ran fifth B and De Villiers with fourth B and Victoria Punch, twelfth B and Vivaldo, and seventh out of nine runners. So just beat two home. Pink Jasmine was the winner. Rated at 66 for tongue strap is number five. Fearless Joey. There you can see on the top of your screen ending up finishing on uh, uh, third last in fact in this occasion is uh, Fearless Joey rated at 66 for tongue strap. Six will be Maple Leaf. The eventual winner in this race is Maple Leave well, just given a tap also and quick and well. Although the margin is just about one and a half lengths with the air display bridging in the gap on every stride, and uh, Maple Leaf uh, managed to win by a margin of one and a half length. Rated at 66, putting Hood uh, is number six. Maple Leaf seven will be Sophia, the eventual winner in this race. Is Sophia was the winner, in fact, uh, having run third, being fondness of you and uh, oh, that seven for long trip came and emerged victorious to win by a margin of. Uh, Three quarters of a length is uh, number seven, Sophia's from Tongue Stop rated at 61. Aquamaric finishing on second in race number 112. The eighth race will be the Division 1 of the Redford Plate. Handicap force is rated 20 to 45. Distance is 1,400 meters. One will be Blue God. The eventual winner in this race is Blue God, where uh, Blue God was the winner by a margin of three and a half lengths. Uh, well, uh, launched an assault and the final 150 meters went ahead and uh, won strongly enough uh, the dying moments of the race by three and a half lengths beating treasure chest rated at uh, 43 from tungsten cross nose band two will be sarai sarai ran third stellantis was the winner of this race and uh, sarai was the one who ran third being vivaldo with eight being nevada gold and third out of uh, six runners being stellantis originally fourth awarded this place uh, at uh, third finished uh, horse was as uh, third horse uh, finished horse was disqualified and Sarai was the one who ran third rated at 42. And uh, three will be amazing attraction. Amazing attraction ran fifth. Royal Miso was the winner of this race. And uh, amazing attraction is that a couple of outings twice fourth and one second on the previous uh, three outings. And in this occasion, fifth out of uh, seven runners, Royal Miso was the comfortable winner. Seven and a quarter lengths was the margin of victory. And that can sum up the story of uh, how good. Uh, 
Royal Mysore won an amazing attraction, ran fifth one tongue stop rated at 40. Four will be the Republican Power and uh, Republic Power and uh, number eight, uh, Embosom are the two runners. Republic Power ran seventh out of nine runners in race number 120. This is the one outing in uh, this current season where Republic Power finished on seventh out of nine runners being Clements one tongue stop rated at 40. Number eight, Embosom. Fourth on the first round when Cinco de Mayo. Second in, second in uh, Southern Fantasy's win. And fourth out of nine runners uh, after doing all the running fell back is Embosom to finish fourth. Clement was the winner rated at 33. Spon Blinkers cross nose band. Five will be Irish rock star. Irish rock star was the one who ran eighth. Uh, Magnus was the winner. Been produced on the wide outside is Irish rock star. This is race number 39. You're looking at multi-dimensional woman award is uh, Irish rock star. Oh, that uh, nine for long trip. And Magnus was the winner, winning by a margin of a long neck. Had to be really worked up uh, to come and eventually win this by a long neck. And Irish rock star, oh, that nine for long trip ran eight. One tongue stop rated at 38. Six will be Greeley. Greeley, the eventual winner in this race is Greeley. Well, uh, waiting to launch an assault at the final 200 meters took over the running and emerged victorious to win by two and a half lengths. although eco-friendly came in far too late to finish on second uh, and uh, Greeley the winner of this race fourth being instructor and fifth being bold act on the previous occasions for blinkers tungsten crosses van hood rated at 36 number seven will be Nevada gold Nevada gold ran third wonder woman was the winner of this race and Nevada gold was the one under the whip given a hard crack or so and ended up finishing on third on the sorting was a winner beating uh, Victoria Dorasani on the previous occasion and this occasion ran third out of nine runners behind, uh, behind the Wonder Woman is Nevada Gold. Sporting Blinkers tongue stop rated at 35. And nine will be Scaffenberg. Scaffenberg ran sixth. Oxytocin was the winner of this race. And Scaffenberg in the silks of uh, light blue with black chevrons. Ace of Border of Arabica ran sixth. Uh, no form at all uh, is uh, Scaffenberg. Has had a couple of outings and all is runs disappointing. Finishing sixth out of seven runners. Oxytocin was the winner rated at 32. So one tongue strap is number nine, Scaffenberg. The last race coming up. As we move on to the uh, ninth race of the evening, the Division 1 of the Madai Plate. Handicap for horses rated uh, 5 years old and over, rated 20 to 45 distance runners, 1200 meters. Number 1 will be Remnator, the eventual winner in this race in a pillar to post victory. Held on to win by a length, in fact, is Remnator. Western Alaska was sentimental, having finished second in his previous outing when Altamont and 12th being Kallu Sakare. In this occasion, winner beating Water doesn't run two races alike, in fact, is Remnator. From Blinker's Tongue Stop rated at 45. Two will be Sheer Bliss. Sheer Bliss was the one who ran seventh on the first outing behind Douglas and in this run finished on 11th out of 11 runners. Southern Force was the winner of this race and Sheer Bliss was the one in race number 58. Oh, that sprint trip ran 11th out of 11 runners rated at 44 spoon blinkers. Number three will be Agera and number six also coming up is uh, Step to Destiny. These are the two runners we have a look at. So Aguera was the one who ran sixth on the sorting, being produced on the wide outside is Aguera, winner in race number 70, in fact, beating uh, Glow in the Dark. And in this occasion, sixth out of nine runners uh, behind Wonder Woman is Aguera, declaration of four out of fast escape is Aguera. This is race number 105, rated at 43 from Tongue Strap, whereas number six, Step to Destiny, finished on seventh, having won a race in race number 53, beating Domina and uh, sixth being Crosswater. Seventh out of nine runners on this occasion is Step to Destiny, rated at 43 three spawn blinkers is number uh, six step to destiny we have a look at bond dancer and number 10 also coming up for scrutiny in this race uh, will be baltimore these are the two runners we have a look at but let's start off with uh, the first runner in fact bond dancer well, uh, won very impressively on this occasion, beating uh, Mega Success by a margin of five and a quarter length is Bond Dancer. Phoenix Star at a Shikshas, but rated at uh, 43 is Bond Dancer. Whereas number 10 in the card, Baltimore, fourth on the first starting being Solo Prince, with third being Cinco de Mayo, and fifth out of nine runners being Bond Dancer. That's the form and credential of Baltimore. A supporter of Chase the Sun from Tungstock Crossnose Band, rated at uh, 30 is number 10, Baltimore. There you see it, uh, Bond Dancer, although slightly shifting out, but uh, in Ended up winning this race quite comfortably by a margin of uh, five and a quarter length. 
measure of time number five in the card one and sixth my vision was the winner and uh, my measure of time was the one who was in the third last position and ended up finishing on sixth out of nine runners ultimately having run eighth behind the uh, stella gold and uh, fourth being top dancer ninth being promise kept seventh being royal mice so sixth being my vision rated at 43 spoon tongue stop is measure of time Osiris comes to next. Osiris was the one who ran fourth. Ahern was the winner of this race and Osiris was the one who ran fourth on the sorting. Oh, that uh, seven for long trip is uh, Osiris. This is race number 135 we're looking at, rated at 41 spun blinkers, tongue stop, cross nose band is number seven, Osiris. Eight will be the strikingly. The striking lead and sixth, Kallu Sakare was the winner of this race and the striking lead has been produced almost six wide off the fence in uh, race number 104 and finished on sixth ultimately is uh, the striking lead. Previously ran second being cross water, two and a half runs behind the winner. But on this occasion, sixth out of 12 dollars, Kallu Sakare, the winner rated at 31st one because tongue strap. Nine will be Peridot. Peridot is the one is out of Sanis Parakmat of uh, Alexandrite is number nine Peridot who ran eighth on the first starting behind a solo prince in race number one of this current winter season. Oh, that uh, 1200 meter trip and subsequently in his next outing in race number 29 ran fourth out of nine runners uh, is the peridot came and finished on fourth out of nine runners castaneda was a winner of this race rated at 33 is from blinkers tongue stop foot and cross nose band is number nine peridot so that's why in the preview of today's races we'll join you on the 9th of march until then thank you from all of us from the cctv room